Greetings. My name is Thomas Murray. I'm a concert organist, and I teach the graduate organ performance majors at Yale University in the School of Music. Recently, I was invited by Peter Richard Conti and the Friends of the Wanamaker Organ to come to Philadelphia to work with Peter on a tonal exploration of the huge orchestral resources of the Wanamaker Organ. The Friends of the Wanamaker had produced a video curator's tour, but the organ is so vast that there was no time in that DVD to sample some of the many sounds the Wanamaker Organ is capable of nor to explore some of the music for which it imparts an unparalleled majesty. Neither was there disc space in that DVD to discuss the art of transcription playing. Because the subtle beauty of this organ can only be completely captured at nightfall when the store closes, Peter and I spent the next several evenings producing the musical portion of this production. But the daylight hours were also put to good use, practicing during daily recitals, greeting visitors and meeting in Peter's office to discuss our art and compare our approaches and philosophies to presenting orchestral music on the pipe organ. So here we are, Tom. Certainly. This is just amazing to look at. One of the world's most magnificent symphonic organs. Solo has a, a wealth of reeds. The soft tuba eight foot is, is a, one of the darker stops on the solo. And then uh, there are brighter reasons. There's a solo trumpet, which is a double trumpet. It's very brassy. Very so, brassy. We've talked about the echo as one of the ancillary divisions, but really the heart of this organ is this amazing string organ. It's 118 ranks, which is about a quarter of the instrument. And Oh, yeah, you want right. to just, I'll just do a, a gradual crescendo of the entire right. string organ with matching the pedal. The entire string organ, yep. so you'll hear them all together. Tom, on to the orchestral, which is uh, all Kimball pipe work, like the string organ, all amazing Kimball pipe work. Pretty much one of everything they ever built, I think, is in this division. It's incredible. And we saved the best for last, in my opinion, these three amazing French horns. And the cool thing is you mix and match these. Here's one and two together. And here's one, two, and three together. French horn chorus. Yeah. So, and then there's some some fabulous reeds. The bombard is a is a unit, 32 through four foot, and uh, there's a 16 foot of it. Mm -hmm. 